good team exclusive and welcome back to some more FIFA 21 content today we are back doing the icon swaps grind I am not looking forward to this well I'm looking forward to playing with the team just not looking forward to the opponents we're going to come up against but we are going to be going out to complete the one nation Brazilian squad um, icon swaps challenge if you watched that last episode or if you didn't Kind of already spawned on screen, but we did manage to win seven games and complete that one. There'd be no point uploading the video if I didn't do it. So obviously we completed that one. And today we will be going out to complete this one. Um we're in good stead to be fair. We won uh won seven games out of the ten we played, which is a pretty good record. Seven for seven for three. Um so hopefully we can kind of have the same same success. Um, I'll be extremely upset and disappointed if I manage to lose um, 44 games and say only win six. That would be horrendous, horrendous record. But this is our Brazilian squad. I did kind of show it off in the last episode. Uh, it's a very good squad, to be fair. Very, very good squad. So I'm hoping we can. Um, I'm hoping we can score some goals, especially with the uh, R9 Ronaldo loan. I knew this card would come in handy eventually. Knew he would come in handy. He's a very good card. Let's uh, jump into the first game. See who we're going to come up against. I wonder if we're going to face up against the uh, the Kent guy again. All right, so here we go for game number one. Who are we going to... Pretty sure I faced this guy in the last episode. I can't remember what he's... I'm pretty sure I beat him as well. Uh, I may not have. A lot of people have got very similar teams, so I might be might be remembering this one wrong. But um, yeah, he looks, he looks quite beatable. Bang. Bang, goal, let's go. What a goal that was. Who was that? That was Jean, Jean Victor. You love to see it. A little turn, turn back, bang, goal. Just things you love to see. Is that going to be game over? Or are you making subs? Looks like he's making subs. Okay. Respectable, respectable. I'm not sure who he can, who he can really bring on. Johnson, Sheaf, Tuluk, Steelers, Olsen. Parish and Clements or Clements. Are we quit? Okay. Well, I mean, it was a good start, to be fair. First game, first victory. Um, very interesting team. Got that um, Champions League Trent. Got Mason Mount, Maury, Fredericks. And he's got Shearer at CDM. I mean, why not, to be fair? Why not? He probably would make quite a good CM camp. Well, probably more like a cam, I would have thought, but. Holy shit, this team feels so stiff. What is going on? Okay, Marquinhos, there we go, doing work. Run, Marquinhos. R9 Ronaldo wants it. Got there as well. He's flummoxed it. And he literally just chipped it to the keeper. Insanity. Ronaldo, please, yes, let's go. Arnon oh, Ronaldo, that was quite lucky to be fair. Quite lucky. Um uh, just winning the rebound and then just just panic passing it really to Ronaldo. But let's go. Second second game. Second victory so far. Very good. I do gotta say though, it's really refreshing having somebody who um you can rely on constantly to once you press B just to score. Albert Lewin was kind of hit and miss. You press B, he wasn't always gonna score. Uh, but Ronaldo and Jean Victor, seemingly, you just press B and they just score. So it's real nice. And fortunately, we're going to have to face against the same problem. But he's got two. I mean, he's got he's got a pack four of left backs. So cool, I guess. Let's go. Yo, you still got it. Let's go. Mm, Ronaldo, damn, he just made the inside run instead of the outside one. And Ronaldo is in. Bang, goal. I told you that you just get run out there in a shooting opposition, uh, opportunity. Press B, he scores. It's so, so nice. <laughs> that's probably going to be our third win. It is. There we are. Third win. I, it's a shame because I actually really like playing with this squad. But it'd be nice to play a little bit more than just like the first five minutes. I'm not going to complain though. I'm not going to complain. I mean, we beat this guy before. I mean, you, you literally couldn't have predicted this kind of start. Uh, it might all go horribly wrong, but we beat this guy once, so we can do it again. Just give the ball to R9 Ronaldo, and it's going to be a goal. 
can't actually remember how I beat this guy the first time around, but no matter. Cut on the inside, cut on the outside. Oof, okay. Martinelli. Doing bits. What? Anderson Taliska. Edge of the box. Finesse got. I actually thought that went in. That was incredible. Wow. That really should have been a goal, but. Oh, fuck, man. Fine. 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 I. Don't, I... I mean, I, I don't know. I can't really say anything anymore. I'm pretty sure we beat this guy before, but we beat the other guy before. And, uh, yeah. I don't know how that went. So that's fucking brilliant. I'm not going to say anything this time because we'll probably end up losing. Wow, okay. Holy. Did not expect it to be that far off. Through. Bang, goal. You don't you don't you don't sleep on Jean Victor, swear down, and he's quit. Cool. Again, he, he put up quite a fight to be fair. <laughs> put up quite a fight. Um but we came out victorious, as per expected. If I can win three in the next five, I'll be quite happy. That'll be uh fourteen and twenty. It won't be terrible. I'll have to see if that's possible though. Another very nice uh, Brazilian team. Quite a slow black backline though. Everyone has a kind of the same. If you've got a Brazilian team, kind of the same backline. Tiago Silva, the ones to watch, and some other like Ed Militao, Palista kind of figure it was interesting. Not that was actually incredibly boring, but still. Root. Bang it. Ronaldo. Yes, there we go. I don't know why Boris keeper. And that's going to be this guy done again. Ronaldo is just a little bit too good. He is sometimes. Actually, most of the time. 99% of the time, he's too good. And there we are. So that is win number five. I just looked at it and I can't actually remember. Um, win number five, I'm pretty sure that is. So we've got two left to go. Game number 644,000, feels like anyway. Got another very standard English team. Very good team, to be fair. Tavernier is a bit of a, a bit of a problem every time I've come up against him. But uh, I mean, it looks beatable as long as he isn't uh, a pro player. That'd be fantastic. Which, in fairness, if it's anybody above like gold level, then uh, I'm kind of screwed. Oh my god, I, I just can't be bothered. I just can't be bothered, man. That's gonna happen as well. Fine. Fine. It just um it really just goes to show that you really can't judge anybody by the quality of their team. Because you just never know really, to be fair. Never know who you're gonna come up against. Like that person we just played was really good apparently. Um even though I felt like I know there's been a new patch and I don't know if that's affected a lot of things, but like some dodgy things going on. Real dodgy. What? Great tackle, Marquinhos. Get up. Great second tackle, Marquinhos. Let's go. Jesus. Martinelli just can't quite get the shot off. Oh, nine, Ronaldo. No. Tackle, Marquinhos. Run past him. Bang. Got to be a goal. Yes. Let's go. Jean Victor. Lots in the back of the net for a very nice, tidy finish. Do love to see it. And that marks our sixth win, I do believe. Is it fifth or. I think it's sixth. Yeah, I'm pretty sure that's our sixth win. Um, that's a nice word to say, isn't it? Sixth. 
sixth. Yo, if this is our seventh, oh geez. Is that the guy we just played? No, that was the guy that we lost against. Okay. Okay. I guess that's where we're going, is it? Ooh, that's a good goal as well. Let's go. That is Jean Victor again get on the score sheet. Good bit of play to be fair. And it was Jean Victor. Things you love to see. Rose has got tons of pace. Tons of pace and space. Bang. What? How does he not get that? Okay. Okay, never mind. Oh, jeez. You don't leave Ronaldo that space. You don't leave Ronaldo that space. Second goal. Banging little finish, to be fair. Good pass through. And then he, uh, he just puts in the back of the net. So let's go. Kidding me, man. Like, that's so undeserved. Defended so well against this guy. Then he's get some cheap rebound. Crazy. Oof. Damn. Maybe I should have shot with Ronaldo there, but... I just wanted to kind of try and secure the goal if I could. Bang! Ronaldo! Oh! Very, very fortunate block, but... Come on, somebody. Eliska! Nope. Oh, Roberto Carlos. Oh! Ah! He didn't have the touch of a lemming. That could have worked out for us. Santos! Offensive sub. Uh, like, he puts in the back of the net. What, what more can you ask for? Takes it off the goal kick, which is very lucky. Um, and then just 95 pace. You're not going to catch him. Oh, but Sergio Santos has so much pace. Bang. Lee Patterson. Bang! Oh... A good shot to be fair. On Ronaldo, win that. Was Ronaldo ever really like known for his headers? Interesting. I don't think he ever was, but hang to somebody, please. Please. Oh, it's gone in. Yes, yeah, Sergio Santos again. The offensive substitute coming up big. I, I don't know. I don't know how that went in to be fair. I don't know how I got the ball, but I will take it. I would definitely take it. Wow. I mean, he, he's really trying it, to be fair. Really trying it. He's not bad, this player. Not bad. I mean, he beat me the first time around. It's just um, we've come up Trump's second one, supposedly, for the moment anyway. Defended really well. Uh, you can't argue with it at all. Great little touch there by whoever that was. No idea. Oh, let's go, Jean Victor. Just run with it. Ronaldo in the space. And get there. Bang. Oh. Henderson. Making a big save. Big save. Come on. Sergio Santos. For the hat trick though. Watch this. Marquinhos. Oh. oh my god. My Marquinhos. What a strike. Look at this. Oh come on. We wanted to see that. We'll watch it at the end. Holy shit. Yo. There's no, there's no coming back from that, and also the fact that you're three, you're three goals behind. But Jesus Christ, what a strike by Marquinhos! You love to see it. Hey, let's go, let's go and have a look at that goal. Damn. Where is it? Marquinhos with an absolute banger. Uh, let's hide that, and we'll hide. That one hide from there. Just touch, strike. Oof. It does not get a, get much better than that. That is one hell of a goal. Uh, Sergio Santos was so close of getting that header in as well. Just didn't quite have, uh, have enough on it. And then... Wow. Wow. What a goal. What a goal that is. What a goal. And I think if Henderson actually properly dived for it, like actually threw himself at it, he probably could have got there. But look at that dive. What is that? 
what is that? You literally just you just stepping to the to the right, I think it was, or the left, wherever we, I can't remember. And um, didn't even try, but wow, wow, wow! What a way to end this kind of icon swaps thing. I mean, bear in mind this guy did beat me the first time around. It was quite convincingly. Uh, it was like three one, I think it was. And look at this, pure, utter domination. I mean, where are my shots from as well? I mean, they weren't from like terrible, terrible angles. We had 14, 13 on target, scored five. He had five and three and scored two. He obviously had more possession, but it, he didn't do much with it. And um, yeah, we just, we just completely dominated him, to be fair. It's really weird how that works. Really weird how that works, but um, insane. Insane game for the final final game of the episode as long as i'm not incorrect that should be that should be our um seven games won and it is there we are you love to see it i don't have to do this again until they release i can swaps number two. Oh my god i really hope they um they take away a lot of the ones that were in squad battles whatever they were like you know who are they Oh, I actually completed them. Yeah, I really hope they take away a lot of the, the ones that are in squad battles. Like, um, I know the first ones were in friendlies and people were doing, like, gold and gold. But, um, ultimately, it doesn't really matter. I don't, I don't really see the, the harm in it. But, um, yeah, hopefully they keep them to friendlies or a, a specific game mode. Um, like, the max chemistry one, I know it's for a different objective. But that one was really good fun. Just playing with players that I could play with any kind of teams... Really, really good fun. Um, I think the way they've gone about it this this time around, having a limit on on the certain games you can play, is not a great idea. 60 isn't terrible, but also if you're not a great player and you lose, like say, 90% of your games, you know, you may not be able to do it, and that's kind of a little bit unfair. So even though with that said, I think 60 games you could probably you should still be able to achieve it quite comfortably. Um I do you want to see? So we've got Torres there. From the MLS, actually, probably would work in my squad quite, quite well. Ironically, um, not that I that, that that I would use him, obviously, but uh, and we also get the Korean goalkeeper there as well. So we'll put those in the club. I think that marks four. We've got. We only need the last one from the weekend league. Um, quickly check on that. So we've got icon swaps. Yeah. So it's just the weekend league one, and then then we'll be able to get the. Um, 8325 pack from icon swaps which is very very good stuff what i do want to have a quick look at though is my overall friendlies record which is i've played oh wow i played 300 280 320 329 games that's insane that's an insane number 320 really wow 329 games of friendlies won 187 of them lost 142 which is a positive record uh, not that it really matters um one nation 5-2 that's the biggest victory apparently i've had oh no that was my latest um records does it actually show like my biggest loss oh, i didn't actually realize it had all this kind of in-depth stats jesus so basically what what that's saying is that if you come up against me in friendlies, uh, more likely than not, your score in the first 25% of the game, uh, in the first 15 minutes of the game, you have a 25% chance of scoring, which is not good. Jesus, okay. Uh, that's really interesting. That's really, really interesting. I didn't realise it had all these kind of, this in-depth look at all of your stats. Build up defending, that's incredible. See, that's the kind of stuff I would love to have more on ultimate team especially for players that i use like you know what part of the game they 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 score in what like part of the goal they score in more what like you know how many more finesse shots they score how many long range goals they score instead of just having it goals it'd be really nice to see how many my maradona how many long range goals he scored how many finesse shot goals um you know penalties that kind of stuff would be really cool to see individually for for each player and like what part part of the goal he scores more in um and for my defenders and goalkeepers like having how many clean sheets they've had how many successful tackles 
you know and that kind of percentage would be so cool to have on and obviously like block shots you can see at the bottom just there that'd be really cool to have for defenders block shots interceptions how many they've done like what percentage you know they do against what they've lost and tackles and that kind of stuff i know you kind of get that in-game statistic in the actual match but it'd be, it'd be so cool to have that on the actual players and goalkeepers especially need like saves clean sheets that kind of stuff because they don't score goals goals is pointless on a goalkeeper um so hopefully the 22 ea um ea actually fix up on that but yeah so there we go there is episode number two of the icon swaps done we are complete we have completed the icon swaps grind hopefully you've enjoyed this kind of uh miniature video series it's a bit a bit different to um the division rivals and um yeah of course next episode we'll be getting back on that uh, i might try and record some of the, the the weekend league games um we'll have to see how that goes but i'm not uh, not 100 percent but either way i've actually really enjoyed it it's been really good fun it's been a bit more been a bit more chilled we use some uh different squads I'd like to do this more in the future when they do icon swaps number two and and other kind of um objectives based things it'd be really good to uh to do kind of a bit of a a, a different few episodes on the road to glory with them because like i said using different squads different players is actually really good fun either way i've enjoyed it hopefully you've enjoyed it as well if you have please do drop uh this video a like that'd be very very much appreciated um if you want to see more of this content um then please do consider hitting that subscribe button if you haven't already um, that would be very, very much appreciated as well. But for now, I do hope you enjoyed. Thank you very much for watching and we'll see you next time.